The solvent involves the area of a polygon. You can circumscribe a circle about any regular polygon. Here's an example. Note the center, the radius of the circle, the circumscribed circle, and the apothem. Problem one, finding angle measures. The figure shown is a regular pentagon with radii and an apothem drawn. What is the measure of each numbered angle? Well, the measure of angle one equals 360 divided by five. 360 representing the number of degrees in a full circle, five representing the number of sides, also the number of interior angles in this regular pentagon. Because it's regular, all the angles are congruent. And that's 72. The measure of angle two is half of the measure of angle one. That's because the apothem bisects the vertex angle of the isosceles triangle formed by the radii. One half of 72 is 36. Now using the triangle angle sum theorem, we know that 90 plus 36 plus the measure of angle three, our third and final unknown angle, equals 180. So we solve and find that the measure of angle three is 54. So we can state the measure of angle one equals 72, the measure of angle two equals 36, and the measure of angle three equals 54. Your turn. In the figure, a portion of a regular octagon has radii and an apothem drawn. What is the measure of each numbered angle?